Hi, this is Andre. If you are in Tinsy and Nidi design, you probably found my boards already useful. These are boards designed for controllers 3.2 and 4.4, which have lots of MIDI connectivity on these. So this is a board for 3.2. It has three MIDI input, three MIDI output ports. The board for controller 4.0 has five MIDI inputs and five MIDI outputs. And then you have lots of pins around these boards, so you define what this board is used for. It can be MIDI merger, splitter, distributor, or it can be a synthesizer, so you have lots of pins around it. You can interface to something that doesn't exist on this board. Well, being very excited about these products, of course, I couldn't, couldn't miss the fact that TZ released controller 4.1, which is just an amazing controller with a lot more powerful with more pins around it that with significantly less complexity that you had to deal before on the software optimization. So, and it has lots of the hardware serial ports that can be used for MIDI. So I took a moment and I designed the breakout board for controller 4.1. So it's a TZ 4.1 breakout board, which has eight MIDI inputs and eight MIDI output ports. Again, similar allocation, similar form factor, and you have pins available around the Tinsy, so you can interface it to something else that it's not here. And obviously every MIDI input has optocoupler and uh, and everything is powered through the Tinsy. Also, because it's a point 4.1, it introduces many features, especially performance features. And it also has many new interfacing features, such as USB host, which exists before, but in this time, I decided to solder it down directly on the board, so you have now USB socket, and you can connect MIDI USB class compliant hardware, so you can, you can run these all together, and you can work with that as a system, so you can process the MIDI events coming from your MIDI keyboard, and output, output that on the MIDI outputs if you want, or you can do some filtering and other stuff, and it can be as I said, it can be a standalone, or it can be your MIDI interface connected to the computer, and then everything that is connected here, you will see on the computer. So, uh, certainly it's the cheapest 8x8 MIDI interface today that you can design easily. Thanks a lot. See you.